scanning. Scanning. Ooh, Vasquez wasn't that ugly. You and me, Pumpkin, let's rock this walk. Whoa, this place is scaring me and I'm a frickin' hologram. Uh, careful now, I don't wanna end up psycho dinner. Disturbing. Not Vasquez's face disturbing, but still disturbing. Glad I wasn't invited to this pizza party. Must have been one hell of a party. You know, in a messed up way, I kind of respect this psycho. I always thought I'd drink or sex myself to death, too. Because those really are the two best options. Atta boy! Need rest. Big day tomorrow. You die, I sleep. Smacky dabby! I should punch with this arm more often. Okay, listen up, because I'm about to compliment you. No one ever became a leader without dirtying their hands. Oh, you're gonna get Hugo McSwoopy Hair's face back, no problem. Next stop, Hyperion, baby. Huh. Kinda looks like my ex-girlfriend. I'd actually be okay with that. Sorry, Stacy. This is a fun night. Looks like we found our psycho. You only see this kind of thing on Pandora. Get me back to Helios, Reese. Pretty please. With strippers on top. We got this. Oof, that is one ugly mug. Um, where... where am I gonna put it? Cram it in your pocket, I don't know. I, I can't mess up his face or the Digistruck won't work. Like a bandage. Quick and painful. Oh. Mmm. Okay. 
Hey, just peeling it off, peeling off a face, not going to barf into his mouth with your mouth. <sighs> That's it, go on, peel off that face like a serial killer. You're sick. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, it's stuck. Mm -mm. Oh, God, that's so... That, that is just the, the grossest thing I've ever seen. Oh, God, oh. I can't stop now. Oh, no, 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 no. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, oh pinch it off. Just pinch it oh, off. Right seriously? Oh, please don't do it. Please, please, please don't do this to me. Oh, gross. Oh. Smash the baby's face! Crunch its teeth! <laughs> Run! You're the only one running, pal! I can fly! So once I snatched that face pizza, gross, I sprinted out of Old Haven. Hundreds, no, thousands of psychos chased me. Oh, really? That many? Couldn't even count them all. You were too busy trying to save the face. Technically, it was one psycho, but he had a bomb strapped to his chest that had the stopping power of like a thousand of which could... So, one. One, yeah. Psycho with chest bomb. Oh! You said something about a bomb, psycho? Oh. Yeah. There. <laughs> Whoa, wait, dude. Oh, we were supposed to bring back the body. Oh, we are still bringing it, baby. It's just gonna take a little longer to collect now. Think I got some baggies in the truck. It ain't pretty, but this one fits your budget. Ugh, are Hyperion costumes necessary? Fiona will fit right in with her spiffy new duds, but Sash, you look about as low-down Pandoran as they come. No offense, but if you want to be arrested within ten seconds, be my guest. Hey, here's your disguise allowance. Don't think it'll be a regular thing or nothing. Get yourself something or get Sasha something nicer so she'll quit whining. Don't care either way. Just don't look Pandoran or this mission will be over before it even started. So, what are you gonna get, sis? All right, let's see what we're working with. Hey, Fiona, the, uh, <clears throat> pricier option ain't too shabby. Plus, I kinda want you to spend all of August's money. Hey! Or whatever, just pick something that says, I look like a stuck-up jerk. Yeah, <laughs> that'll work.
All right. Thanks, V. I'll try it on in a bit. Hope it's worth the cash. Could have bought a lot of guns with that. That'll look good. Are you both blind? <whistles> Scooter. You look like a dream! You're up, Saj. Make it quick. Huh. Not bad. Makes me feel like I could drink the tears of a million dream-crushed orphans. I'll fit right in at Hyperion. Hey! Hurry it up already! I don't got all day! Uh, wh wh why would you do that? Whoa, whoa, sorry. I <laughs> just, I don't know, kind of popped in the old head and I... I, I thought it, I thought it'd be funny, but obviously I was very, very wrong. Uh, so sorry. I don't know what I was thinking. Sorry. I just gotta scan it for the thing. Yeah. Hey, is this disguise gonna work? I figure you're the one with the eye for this. You and Vaughn are the only Hyperion I know, and you dress terrible. So. Maybe I should just take my chances. You look like absolute corporate scum. Huh, awesome. That's what I was going for. Yeah, well, mission accomplished. One thing. Hmm. I mean, being Hyperion is just as much about the attitude as, as the clothes, so... Uh, it, put, put your nose up like you're, you know, uh, tracking down a stench. Better? Perfect. Anyway, it's all yours. Thanks, just gotta scan my... Severed face here. Yeah, have fun with that. Just get to the skin screen and... Please scan skin. Oh, there we go. Okay, skin scan. Oh, God. Oh, God. Much worse from this side. Oh. Skin unlocked. Convincing. Is it? Yeah, I mean, you look like a complete douchebag. Excellent. That is the look I was going for. This is... <laughs> oh, definitely weird. Well, it's certainly... Big. <sighs> That's Scooter for you. I hope Vaughn's all right. I'm sure Cassius is looking out for him. We'll track them down when we get back.
to see this. Hey, you look like you've done that. Like you've done that before. I know it's where we're from, but... It's never felt like home to me. I... I didn't think I'd ever see this. Guess you kept your promise. I always do. At least, with you. It looks so... I don't... Peaceful. Who'd have thought? We haven't even gone that far, and it all feels a million miles away. It puts things in perspective. Everything that we've gone through, it all seems so small from up here. Yeah, it does. It's a shame we have to go back. Wish we could just turn this thing towards the nearest planet. We'd probably run out of fuel, so it's not a good idea, but... You know, it's an idea. One day we won't have to. We'll be able to pick whichever planet we want. <laughs> I can't wait. Ugh, I keep forgetting they're here. Once we get the beacon, we'll figure out a way to turn things back in our favor. Any ideas on how exactly we do that? Or are we just winging it? Again. I know we're good at improvising, but... Eh, we wing it. Huh. Of course we do. When you're good at something, why stop? Hey, watch it! Oh, sorry man! Just got a wife for me is all. It ain't bleeding or nothing. What the hell is this damn thing? It's, uh... Well, it's a satellite. Gonna launch it to, to advertise my franchise. You know what they say? Ain't no ad space like outer space. Of all the brands, you pick the one Hyperion hates. We're not drawing more attention to ourselves for some publicity stunt. 
Hey, there's no Whoa! need for that. Stop it! Come on, man. I gotta get some out of this trip. We won't be alive to collect it if we get blown into dust. We'll talk about it on the way back. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, I get it. Prioritizing and all. It's cool. It's cool. Warning. Green collision imminent. <laughs> Is that a person? Hey, looks like we've got another dead bad guy. Henderson. Impact detected on center rocket booster. No shit. Tell us something we don't know. Did you know the damage is critical? So this is how I die. I knew it. I knew it! Whose idea was it to bring this tin can? We could really use your advice here. This ship requires additional thrust. Okay. Without additional thrust, the ship will be pulled back towards Pandora. Which is bad. Pretty bad. Yeah. Look, y'all, we need to do some compensating right here, and y'all are in luck, because that's my specialty. Now turn them other rockets up to 11. Stop, man. Sears. No way, man. I'm just getting started. We got this. Scooter! Why is the whole ship shaking? No, that's just because we're running real high right now. Like, kind of scary high. But what? We're going to take it to the limit. Okay, we're about to hit escape velocity. And when we do, you got to shut these puppies down. You hear? Yeah. Yeah, I hear. Do you? How can you hear anything? Achieving escape velocity in five, four, three... Two, one, go! <laughs> so then, why are the alarms still going? Now nah, that was just step one. We can't do step two without step one. Booster of rocket failure imminent. What does that mean? They're going to explode. Step two, let's do this! Uh... When are they gonna explode? Very soon. What's step two? We get out there and we handle these uncooperative rockets. Oh, right. Step three is us making out. What? Huh? What? Huh? Don't you worry, your pretty little. Yeah, all of you, yeah, but yourself. But I'll be walking you through it, though. Now there's a yellow. 
yellow button in there that you gotta push. That's step one. Right. The button wedged all the way in the back. Oh, you got it? All right. No! What? <laughs> when you press it, you gotta pull your arm out real quick because it's gonna clamp down something fierce. You got me? Be careful. You're almost there. was the first casualty of the mission.
What did we do? We honored him as best we could. Launching this on the way back isn't good enough. We're doing it now. Make it something good. It's the least we can do. The worst part is, Scooter was the best of us. He deserves so much better. He was definitely one of the nicest people I met on Pandora. Although that's not probably saying much. Anyway, we didn't have much time to mourn and all that. Things started to get crazy the minute we landed on Helios. So, uh, if that's not it, uh, answering. Perfect. You have entered Hyperion airspace. Identify yourselves immediately. Okay, gang. <laughs> there we go. I repeat, identify yourselves or you will be shot down. Do not come any closer. We will fire. It's Hugo Vasquez. I'm back. Hugo, huh? I guess we should roll out the red carpet. Uh, for starters, yeah, I'd also like some bubbly chillin' in my office. Just, uh, not too cold, mind you. How about a warm bucket of piss? <laughs> You're lucky good old Hugo has a sense of humor. Get inside and disable security. I'll call you when it's safe to come out. Time to put on the game face. You've got some things to answer for. Vasquez. Almost seems like, uh, what's the word? Providence? Right. Providence. Well, now, if it isn't cock knock and Tweedledick, how's about you get out of my way and let me go do my job? I really hope I get an excuse to kill you. Orders are to verify what the hell you are doing down on Pandora. Ah, take it easy, guys. I just landed. In a hunk of Pandoran trash, no less, with half a loader bot stuck to the top. Hard. And what's that thing you dropped say? Catch a... Whatever the hell it says, it was a doll satellite. Now I suggest you start telling the truth before I blow your head off. So, what were you doing down there? Not too often the top brass venture to that dirt pile. You want to know what I was doing on Pandora? Your mom. My mom is dead. Oh. Yeah, but I got, you know, very important places to be. So I'll just be... What am I doing? Nah. Nah? What do you mean, nah? Here's how it is. You come up here full of piss and bullets, and the first thing you do is dishonor the memory of my mom. So no, you're not going anywhere. I'll take it from here. Hey, Batch, so good to see you. We need to catch up.
Bring it in for testing. What the hell happened to Reese? This is unbelievable. It wasn't supposed to go down like this. Well, he had a... he had a little accident. He's in pieces! I know. Reese's pieces. It's terrible. His death, not the button. I'm not taking the blame for this. Our deal was clear. You were supposed to retrieve his head so management could download whatever the hell was inside of there that was so damn valuable. Now we'll never collect the reward. Cause you lost a critical Hyperion asset. This is on you. You're not even a little sad? I thought you were close. That's none of your business. You and I had a deal. But he was your friend. If you think you can distract me, think again. You had one job, and, well, you blew it. I'm taking you straight to management. Let's see how you like answering to them. I've had it with you. Let's see how big of a smartass you are under questioning. How many baggies would you like? Excuse me? Well, it's just that my colleagues tend to die badly. Anderson, Reese, I could go on. And if things were to go south, I'd like to know your preference. One big bag or a bunch of little ones? Maybe with the cute zip ties? They make them in a million colors. Never start what you can't finish. Standing by in the caravan. Tell us when it's safe to move. The vet's scanning the body, so we gotta hurry. I'm taking over the cameras now. Child's play.